We're doing good. Very good. Oh God, that kind of hurt. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> Hey, I'm McKenna. I'm Griffin. And if you saw our last video, you know that our dad has tested positive for the virus and the lab lost our mom's results, but we are proceeding as if she is infected, which means we are in quarantine. Do you have your results back? I do not. My, um, my results were lost um, between the <clears throat> the clinic and the lab where they were to be tested. Uh, so I had to return um, five days later and get retested. And now it's five days later and I still don't have my results. I acted like I had it from the moment I went to get tested. And so I wouldn't be doing anything differently than I'm doing now. I'm just isolating myself. I assume I have it. And also, who can blame these people that are working around the clock to test? And I mean, I'm fine. I'm just acting like I'm positive, and that way I'm quarantined, I'm doing all the things I can do to keep myself and others safe. So my, my dad has uh, mild symptoms, um, thankfully. Um, we're, we're really blessed. Um, he doesn't seem to uh, really have anything much worse than, you know, a uh, mild fever and cough, and uh, and um, that, that's pretty much it. Loss of taste and smell. Given that I was already fairly along in having symptoms, but symptoms that were not terribly grave, uh, I wasn't I wasn't freaking out. I was glad to know one way or the other. You know, we're staying at home and we're not going out uh, getting groceries like we did two weeks ago when there weren't all those um, those social distancing orders anyway and when no Nash in place yet. and Nashville wasn't in a full uh, shelter in place then so we've just been you know really locked down in the house for the past two weeks wait what did you just spell <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> my parents are okay um, and it doesn't really seem like we have too too much to, to be worried about compared to you know the the rest of the situation in in the country um you know we have to say that we have to see how that plays out but you know just got to keep our spirits high and and yeah we're supposed to say six feet apart yeah my biggest fear is that you or your brother will be infected and uh test positive um, particularly you given your underlying health conditions mm -hmm. i'm a type 1 diabetic I was a dime. <laughs> so we're getting an Australian Shepherd, which is really exciting because I follow so many Instagram accounts of Australian Shepherds because I'm obsessed with them. And look at my water bottle. Aussie butts make me nuts. They do. We're really excited. Um, he's a rescue, but we don't have a name yet. I want to name him Salim. Oh my, no, we are not doing that. <laughs> that was the name of my first crush. <laughs> so we have uh, a ton of suggestions just from us that we have thought <laughs> of over the, uh, the past week or two. So Rex is one of them. Pepper, which is cute. Finn, which is half of my name. Sammy, Salvador, Scout. And shelter in place, sip. And that sounds like a curse word, um, but it's not. It's, this is also mom. It's a bad joke. Also mom. Also mom. <laughs> But if you have uh, any suggestions that you uh, want us to consider,
then, uh, you know, on the YouTube page, just in the comments, drop them below, and uh, we'll pick the ones we like and put them in. What else do you have to do? <laughs> Be honest. Right, what else do you have? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. We know you're at home. Dad, how are you doing? Yeah. I'm good. No problem. I feel good. I think I'm, you know, getting past the worst of it by far. I've been very lucky compared to uh, many people out there. My own, the mask, which I don't wear all the time, when I, I wear the mask, it, it's interesting. It fogs up my glasses. They never talked about this. Um, we don't talk about this on the news, but if you wear glasses and you have a mask, then the mask fogs up the glasses. <laughs> My brother is literally in an online class right now and clearly playing the guitar as well. <laughs> the advice is to stay inside and um, we'll continue to abide by that advice. All right, everyone, the time is now. I am finally leaving the apartment because my brother just tested positive, and so I'm going to get tested. I'm doing one of the um, drive-through tests, though, so I don't actually have to get out of the car. I'll have my face mask, have my gloves, and I'll, um, I'll be filming so you guys can see what it's like. Um, I'm having mostly like upper respiratory things. Hello. I'm Dr. Mallon. I'm going to be doing your test today. Okay, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, they're going to be doing your paperwork. To do your test, I'm going to be taking a narrow swab, mm -hmm. putting it through your nose to the back of your throat. Mm -hmm. It'll be just a tiny bit uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. It'll make you tear, it might make you cough or sneeze. Mm -hmm. um, it takes about seven days to get the results. There is on the form a um, way that you can sign up to uh, look online, or there's a number at the bottom of the sheet that you'll receive that you can call, and there is a uh, way that you can text to sign up as well. And there are instructions for how to take care of yourself in the time that you're waiting. Great. Lay your head back. Like this. Put your chin up like this. There, there you go. Perfect. Perfect. Doing good. Very good. All right. Doing real good. That's it. <laughs> Those are your eyes water. That means she got a good one. <laughs> good. It, she did. And then the number at the bottom. Great. Oh God, that kind of hurt. Yeah. <laughs> it's not that bad. No. So that's what we've been up to. But uh, please stay at home. We hope everyone is healthy and that your loved ones are healthy. Um, if you don't stay at home, even if you just go out for a walk, remember gloves, a mask if you have it, and a lot of this. More importantly though, wash your hands. We'll see you next time.